Hey guys, and welcome back to this video on my newbie channel. In this tutorial, we're going to be trying and making a car system uh, damaging. So if you drive into something, uh, the, the health for the car will drop down. And once it's zero, the car will um, just uh, catch fire. Um, if you haven't subscribed yet, go and do it right now because it really supports me out. And if you want to if you want to become a member, make sure to do that if you want. And um, click the blue join button down below. And ask your parents for advice if you want. Lovely. Anyways, we should um, start off by getting a car in toolbox. Uh, car. Then you can choose a car. I'm gonna try Tesla Roadster. Why not? Seems cool. Oh, wow. This is not sponsored by Tesla. No, no, no. Okay, so first of all, you wanna make a part. You wanna put it in front of the car. Make it a little bit off the car. Well, I don't believe if that's necessary. Okay, we'll see. So you just want to make it the size of like the front. Well, maybe a little bit like this. Okay, I'm just gonna put it like that. Mm, yep. You wanna make it? You wanna name it Hit? I'm just gonna name it Car. Um, you wanna put that Hit into body. And why is this like that? Okay, I want to just do that. Then get the hit part. And, and keep it like that. You want to make another part. You want to make it a bit higher. And you want to get it like over here. And you want to make it, you want to name a smoke part. You want to insert a smoke. And a fire. But we're going to make the fire bigger. Heat 25. Uh, 25 so it's a oh that's a bit big just 15 I'm gonna disable all of them make this part invisible by setting the transparency to one set the hit part to 0.5 so we can see it for the tutorial um, so we want to be doing a few things so in the hit part I want to insert two sounds um, three scripts oh uh, and um, some uh, par particle emitter and a number value. So this is going to be the crash crash handler. This is going to be the health handler. This is going to be um, the, the, the just the main handler. This is going to be the break effect, and this is going to be the collide effect um, sound. Yes. This is just going to be the uh, sparks, sparks damage, and this is going to be health. So, you want to rename all of those to this? Yes. Oh, what am I? What do you? What do you mean? Okay. Um. So we're gonna first of all do the uh, crash script. So I'm gonna remove this. It's fairly simple. Uh, script the parent the touched colon connect function hit and we want to type an enormous stupid line if script the parent dot velocity dot magnitude is above uh, hit dot velocity dot magnitude plus 10 and hit that can collide is x x true so if that's all true Good to go. Oh, tur, true. Uh, or hit dot velocity dot magnitude is above script dot parent dot velocity dot magnitude plus thirty five. Then, yeah, that that's just the big line. I know. Um. Then we're just gonna disable the script script dot parent dot uh, script dot disabled. Is true? Um, and then script the parent. Well, local health is equals to script the parent dot health. Health dot value is equals to health dot value minus script dot parent dot velocity dot magnitude divided by one point twenty five. So um, it's just gonna divide by one twenty five every single moment. Uh, we're gonna wait a second. 
and then uh, if health.value is equals to zero, so if it's above zero, sorry, then script the parent that sparks spark damage yep, that enabled is equals to true. Um, local sound is equals to math.random one and two, so just gonna do that. If sound is equal six to one, so if the number is one, then uh, we're not gonna do anything. If sound equals six to two, then and this is the tricky part. And for this one, you wanna uh, uh, type the numbers uh, you see on the screen right now: four nine zero three one four five five zero. There we go. Set it to I don't know five. Uh, and for the collide, you want to type two, one, five, 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 mm, zero, eight, five, one. Just like that. Five. Um. Okay. Okay. So. Uh, we want to do that over here again. Script dot parent dot. Um, oh, we did it wrong, I believe. I think we did it wrong. Give me a second. Yep, I figured out I did it wrong. Um, what we want to do is for break. Want to do the um the, the 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 numbers you see on your screen right now? I'm just gonna copy paste. That's faster, and, for, and then over here, script the parent dot collide dot playing. No, sorry, that sound ID is equals to rbx asset ID colon slash slash, and then the numbers you see on the screen. And then you want to copy that, paste it in here, but instead of those numbers, you want to do the numbers on the screen again. Just like that. Then you want to do script dot parent dot collide dot playing equals to true. Uh, we're gonna wait. We're gonna wait zero two seconds, and then after we did that, after we waited, we can do um, script dot parent dot sparks damage dot enabled equals to false. Wait again and script dot disabled x to true, uh, false. I am a bit tired. Sorry. Uh, if that's not the case, then script dot disabled x to true. But script dot parent dot break dot playing. Um, is x to true. Um, and we're gonna do wait fifteen. And that is it. So this is your first script uh, done. We're gonna hop over to the main handler. It is, this one is a really tricky one. Script parent. The touched colon connect function touch. Um, no hit. If hit the parent colon find first child humanoid, then so it's there's a humanoid. Uh, if script dot hit. Um, oh, there has to be a bool value named hit. If hit dot value equals, equals to false, then the, we're going to set it to true by saying script dot hit dot value is equals to true. Local um, uh, number one is equals to 10 divided by 12 times 60 divided by 88. Those are just random numbers. Local number two. Is equals to math the floor uh, number one times script dot parent dot velocity dot magnitude and then local hum local hum is equals to hit the parent column find first child humanoid that um humanoid that health is equals to humanoid that health minus uh number two times two 
and we're gonna wait five seconds and then set it to uh, false again so now we only need to do one more script and uh, it's pretty easy while to do wait f script the parent dot health set value is below 50 if the if it's below 50 script the parent the parent dot smoke parts dot smoke dot enabled secrets are true and if it's not the case so if it isn't then we're just setting it to false you want to copy this again boom and if it's below one and set the fire and fire just like that so let's test that out right now oh no we did one more thing wrong want to get the um want to go to the you want to just go to spark damage and um when you see you want to set the texture yep to the numbers you see on the screen right now Oh my, what is this? My influence one. I think I did something wrong. Let me just fix these. I'm going to do the exact same thing. Um, rate is going to be 600. Oh, this is going horribly wrong. Uh, oh, lifetime is supposed to be 2 by 5. Uh, I did something horribly. Oh, okay. 0 minus 50 comes 0. Oh, okay. Well, that's at least something. I think the size has to be down. Maybe just 0 0.5, 0 0.1. Well, that that's cool. So, I'm gonna do size 0 0.1, texture, acceleration 0 point minus 50 comma 0, lifetime 2.5, 2.5, rate 600, rotation 0, rod speed minus 50 comma 50, speed 15, spread angle. 50 minus uh, 50 comma minus 50 so we're gonna set this to uh, false we're gonna set our um, do I, we do something wrong uh, no we're just gonna test this out with a part just set it like that okay uh, I'm just gonna anchor everything play and then we're just gonna test this out right now What? Oh! Haha. Uh -huh. I'm gonna go to your um, health and set it to 100. Alrighty. So now if you get in a car. Oh. Oh, it's because it touches the ground. Oh my. Okay. Just get it off the ground. There we go. And as you see, it does matter if it touches the car or not. So, there we go. Getting the main card. Yep. As you can see, that works for now. So if we just um, go into the car, body, head, and then health, you're going to see 100. And if we ram into this, boom, minus 15, and we get smoke and fire. Um, There's one thing I want to retest, and that is the damage if we get damaged by the player. So if we just get in the car, we just go slowly, I don't know, just one. Oh, that is too slow. Really? Uh, that goes also horribly wrong. Uh, I'm gonna get an MPC. Zombies, why not? Oh, goody. So if we just try and boom him. If we get a zombie real quick, I don't know, just like the other zombie, please. Okay, play.
Yeah, I know the zombies are gonna come for me and boom as you can see we can legit just uh, drive zombies down and boom Well the car catch fire, but if you boom him so one more time Just one more time Uh Oh that goes horribly wrong Which one is it? Okay, that one boom and he's dead, as you can see. So, uh, that is just a quick tutorial. And if you enjoyed, do not forget to like and subscribe. And see you on the next video. Peace out. Goodbye. Yes.